Welcome everybody to another VPOP Pro video. VPOP is your dedicated veterinary preoperative orthopedic planner and it's available for your iOS devices, your iPads, your iPhones, Windows and MacOS. It's available for download at vpoppro.com. In this video we're going to be learning how to use the circle tool and the common tangent uh, method as well for measuring advancements in TTAs. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to calibrate our radiograph here. So we're going to go to menu in the top right and we're going to click and look for image. And the first message that you'll get when you import your radiograph is this. So you've got to calibrate it. So click OK. And now we're going to move our line to our radiographic marker. Now we can move it parallel around the screen or we can click on either end and it goes into precision mode so you can now move that around to one end of your marker and you can move this again to the opposite side of the end or indeed you can use the circle tool as part of the calibration process by clicking here and you can swing that in to complete and overlap your circular radiographic marker and then click other or any number on here that corresponds to your known radiographic marker length or width in this case. It's 20 millimeters in this case, so we'll just click two centimeters and calibrate. Now VPOP Pro has a reference, so we can now start to use the circle tool. So if we go to tools here and we want to measure a distance, a radius or angles, it's the first section here, so we'll just click on here and up comes our line again. So we can, on our smart palette here, which we can move around wherever we want to, for that's convenient, we can either go to the set length, which is the, the first option that you get, or we can go to radius or diameter. So as you can see here now, by clicking on radius or diameter, we have various options that we can scroll through here. So we're gonna to go to radius to start off with. And you can position the center of this wherever you want to or indeed you can move the circle around the screen by clicking on the line there you are so on the edge of the circle we're going to go to the edge of our tibial plateau and then we're going to move in and we're going to zoom in just to get a better clarity here and we can move in to approximate the curvature of our tibial plateau. Once we're finished, we can just click outside of that and there we have our line delineated along the radius and our circle there. Now, if we wanted to delineate a circle on the femoral condyle, again, just click up on your menu, go to tools, and then click distance, radius, and angles up here. Again, we have another line we can select radius again we can move the center wherever we want to around the screen we can move the circle click and drag wherever we want to and then we can also click on the edge the periphery of the circle there and we can move that wherever we want to to approximate our circle so once we're finished click outside and we have our two delineated circles. So the other thing you can do here now is to join the centers of the circles. So we can go to again, menu, tools, distance, and we can go to the center of our circles here. And then if we wanted to measure the advancement for this TTA, we could simply move that forward across to here or if we wanted to delineate our common tangent to both what we could do here is join the intersection of both of these And if any, at any time you want to remove the circles, just go to 
your menu, image, and you can toggle on and off here with your measurements. So that's the circle tool in VPOP Pro. Thank you very much for your interest.